Welcome to Microsoft Project 2016 Tutorials. In this video, I will show you how to enter estimated task durations. Let's open the project we created before and start at the entry table. Make sure you only enter the duration information for the lowest level tasks. These are the activities that define the work needed to complete the deliverables and that actually consume resources and time directly. We start with the first of these activities under the duration column. You can use up and down arrows to switch to other activities. Interviewing users is estimated to take 7 days. Defining the requirements will take 1 day. Designing the logic for the software will take 3 days, and so on. Now that we have entered all the estimated durations for all the lowest level activities, we can see that Microsoft Project has automatically summarized the duration of each major deliverable based on the information that we have entered. The default time unit used for this project is days. This can be changed by simply typing in the time unit that is most appropriate for the project. For example, this can be minutes, hours, weeks, or even months. The most appropriate time unit for this project will be days. Make sure you select a time unit to use throughout the project and on all tasks. Ok, that is how to enter estimated task durations in Microsoft Project 2016. If you like this video, please subscribe and share. This is Yun Wang, and I'll see you in the next video.